Hi folks, I'm going to show you how to fix uh, a common error that happens when you use Mumble. And the error is called wrong password for registered users, please try again. There's variations of that error, but um, it's pretty easy to fix. The main causes for this would be that you formatted your PC and not backed up your certificate. So you format your PC and you've destroyed your certificate or you buy a new laptop or PC and you connecting back to your Mumble server and you're trying to connect with your existing username. So mine is Juggernaut and I'm trying to already have a Juggernaut on the server. And I tried to connect again. It says the name already exists. Um, on Mumble that has to be, every name has to be unique. <coughs> and the name is attached to a certificate. So uh, the quickest fixes for this would be to either rename your, uh, just add a number at the end of your name, or import your old mobile certificate, or the very last step would be to get an administrator to uh, either rename your name on the server or delete it. Usually it's the quickest just to delete it, remove the name from the registry. So I'm gonna show you how to fix this yourself uh, in a less than a minute okay so here goes so you start up mumble i already have it started and it's mumble 1.28 so i start it up click connect and you can see that i have the error here wrong certificate or password for registered user uh, so i'm going to show you how to fix this and get connected to mumble real quick so you click connect you go to your shortcut i have several of them so you just go right click edit and just add a number to the end of your name one two three four so i just add a number to it click connect there we go i've connected but i have no rights to move around on the server but this is easily fixed and you could just get a you contact an admin or you just get a friend of yours and they drag you down into one of the channels and you get sorted quick and easy the next step would be to import your certificate this you can use this method if you've backed up your certificate um, which I'll show in another video how to do this and you'll see the link up on the top right so you click configure certificate wizard you go to import certificate which is pretty easy this is like a very short wizard you find where you've um, exported your uh, certificate so you click open mine is currently on my desktop and I've stored it in a folder called certs. Usually I would store it in a Dropbox or Google Drive or OneDrive or whatever you want. Um, email is another option as well. As long as it's not on your PC and you're able to get at it. They're very small files, only maybe two or three kilobit. So this is my certificate here, Juggernaut. So I'll click next, next and finish. And just uh, click reconnect so I'm just going to connect again you now see that I've access to the server I can move anywhere I want um, so and you can see that I have a little kind of person symbol around my name which means I'm authenticated and registered on the server so that's the quickest way to get up and running Another way would be to rename yourself on the server to so you can connect. So I'll show you that method. So you go down and find the name in the server. It'll be mine is under Juggernaut, obviously. So I'm just going to use that. You just rename it. Um, so you, or you could click on it and you could remove, but obviously I'm not going to do that. So click OK, test. Um, this method will allow you to connect to the server with your original name so it could be Juggernaut if I connect to the server now it will be uh, Juggernaut test or something stupid like that yeah Juggernaut test right if you have any further questions just ask below on the channel I'll help you out I have quite a I have quite a lot of experience using Mumble I've set up hundreds of servers so I know what I'm talking about um, thank you for your time and hopefully this helps.